Hi guys, welcome to X Hit with me, Rebecca Louise. Now, today we're going to be doing a military workout and it's all about stamina. So I'm going to improve your stamina and endurance by putting you through your paces with some really hardcore exercises. So, if you think you've got what it takes, let's begin. If you're ready to build up your stamina, let's get cracking. So, bringing it down to the floor, we're going to be in a, a V-sit like this and we're going to bring one leg across, we're going to bring it up and we're going to use our triceps to bring us up and down, keeping that stomach really nice and tight. Now we're going to do 40 seconds each side. So let's put that left leg over the top first, bring it in, and we're just going to drop down. Just easing into those arm muscles. If you want to make it harder, you can bring your leg out. Or if that is too hard, you can bring both legs together. I'm going to put mine back across over here, just pushing up and down. It's going to really strengthen that upper body, pulling that stomach in nice and tight, keeping that head straight and the back straight too. Keep just pushing it up and down. Try not to touch the bottom on the floor, but you want to get as low as you can without touching. Less than 10 seconds on this rep, guys. Keep going. You should really be feeling it in those arm muscles. Last one, and relax. Okay, let's swap it right over. Just give those arms a little bit of a shake. Bring it back over and let's put it up for another 40 seconds. Okay, so let's dip it down. Really pulling up as we come up and squeezing those glutes too. You can hold your leg out here, it's going to make it even harder. Or putting your leg back down is going to make it easier. So we've got lots of different variations so that if you, as long as you just keep going, you can keep increasing it and decreasing it depending on how your arms are feeling. So you're really feeling it in those triceps. Less than 10 seconds to go. Really dip it down. That's good. Keep going and relax. Okay, let's go on to our stomachs. Now, I've done some research and I know that in the military they do a lot of swimming training. Now, we don't have a pool right now, but we can improvise. So, it's like the Superman, but we're just gonna swim. Just like this, just really opening up our chest and our legs and squeezing our glutes in. So let's do 40 seconds. Okay, time on the clock, let's go. So just swimming it out. Just prete pretending that you're swimming through the ocean. This always makes exercises a lot more fun too. So just push it up, see if you can lift that chest even higher. Bringing those legs in and squeezing those glutes as you come through. Excellent job, keep going, keep with it. Remember, it's all about the determination and the effort that you put in. The more effort, the better a result you're gonna get. Keep going, keep swimming it through. Less than 10 seconds to go, guys. You're almost there. And keep going. Five, four, three, two, and one. Well done, hand release. Okay, we're gonna go back onto our backs. We're gonna do V sit-ups and then we're gonna change it up by running in between. So we're gonna do 30 seconds, going in and out, extending the leg. We're gonna come up, and we're gonna jog really hard for 15 seconds. And we're gonna do that two times through. So, let's start with that V sit up, arms out, and let's take it here for 30 seconds. Just bring it in and out. Really extending those legs, pulling in nice and tight. Just working those abs really, really strong. Remember, after we've done this, we're gonna do 15 minutes of really, really quick running. 15 seconds of running. Okay, keep going. You're gonna feel it in those quads too. So really suck in that stomach. Five, four, three, two, one. And quickly get up, and then we're gonna run really, really quickly on the spot. This is interval training, so we're just matching it up to some cardio, and it is also strengthening our body too. Okay, keep going, like, run really, really quickly on the spot, as fast as you can. Five, four, three, come on, keep pushing, two, one, and straight back down. Go straight back into 30 seconds of the V-set. Okay, push it down, keep with it, guys. You're doing an excellent job. You should be proud of yourselves. Just keep going, don't stop. And if you need to, just rest here for a moment to catch your breath, and then let's come back right into it. Okay, keep pulsing. Less than 10 seconds. And we're gonna do another 15 seconds of running. Okay, let's keep going. Five, 
four, three, two, one. Okay, straight back up again, and then run really, really quickly into it. Go on, push it hard, guys, keep going. Really, really hard. 10 seconds to go. Go on, faster. You can do it even faster. Pushing it really hard. Five, four, three, two, one. And relax. That's great. If you need to, just stretch out those legs. But if you're ready, we're gonna go into high knees. This is gonna be pretty hard. If you need to relax, you can just do one at a time. And we're gonna try and do a minute, okay? So do the best you can. It'll be worth it in the end. If you're ready, minute on the clock, let's go. So high knees, nice and nice and high. I'm gonna see if you can touch your knees with your hands. Keep going. If you need to, just relax it down to a jog as long as you're moving the whole time. Just want to make sure that we're keeping that heart rate up. And keep doing as many high knees as you can. <sighs> Breathing at the same time. If you want to, bring one knee up at a time, just to catch your breath. But it's good just to keep moving. You're halfway through your minute of high knees. Now this is really hardcore. This is what they do in the military. Just think how much stamina that they have. And we're gonna catch them up if we can. Okay, keep going guys. Excellent job. It's worth it in the end. Keep pushing it guys. Going back to a jog if you need to. Less than 10 seconds to go. Let's pull those knees up. Really nice and high. Try and hit your hands. Four, three, two, one. And relax. Okay, keeping up with the cardio, we're gonna go into butt kicks. One minute again. So it's just bringing our feet up and kicking our butt. You can do this for a whole minute too. So a good time just to breathe, just to put it down a second. Take it down a notch. Excellent job guys, you're halfway, over halfway through your workout. Just feel, you're gonna feel so good tomorrow when you wake up. Maybe a little bit stiff, so make sure that you do stretch out properly afterwards. Keep kicking that butt. Remember if you need to, just step it out, that's fine. 30 seconds to go of this one. Keep jogging it, kicking those butts. Like this, you wanna just keep touching. And keep breathing. Okay, nearly there guys, come on. Stay with me, stay with me for these butt kicks. 10, nine, eight, keep going. Almost there, four, three, two, one. Hand release. Okay, let's just stretch out those quads quickly. Just want to hold on to one leg, stretch it out because we have really been using those for the last few exercises. Take a moment to breathe. Remember, if you do need to do more stretches throughout, just press pause, give your body a good stretch, and come back. Okay, now we're going to go back down onto the floor. We're going to do the side planks, but we're going to switch each side. So we're going to Go up into the side plank using those obliques. Put your arm up. We're going to change. And we're going to do this side. So it's just rolling in the middle and putting the arm up here. Okay, we're going to do 30 seconds of those. So, time on the clock. Let's go. 30 seconds, that's it. Hold it up. Switch it over. Bring it up. Really holding in that tummy muscle. Holding in those obliques. It's all about how you do it, the technique. We want to do it properly rather than doing it really quickly. Okay, let's go over, pushing it up, holding those obliques in, lifting up, making sure those hips don't drop. Okay, well done. Let's take one more, hold it there, and relax. Okay, now, back up again. We're gonna do, it's like a burpee, it's a sprawl but we just don't want to do the jump on the end. So, we take our legs together, down into the push-up position, and back up again. We're just going to repeat that as many times as we can within 40 seconds. So take it at your own pace, but try and keep up with me if you can. Okay, if you're ready, let's go. 40 seconds on the clock. So you want to go straight into that push-up position, come back up, and then just stand nice and tall. Bring it out, bring it back. You want to be careful that when you go down that you don't do two feet. You want to bring them both at the same time. So let's jump down, bring it out, bring it back in again. 
If you want to, it makes it more exciting. You can move it round in a circle. So you bring it up and you keep going round. It's going round and round. See how many you can do within 30 seconds. Within 40 seconds. Okay, keep going guys. You've got less than 10 seconds left. You can see I'm moving around here. Five, four, three, two, one, and release. Okay guys, excellent job today. You did fantastic. If you do manage to keep up with me, perfect. <laughs>